so hi children how are you all and here i am coming with the new origami craft here this is for the age group of uh, pre group and that to nursery so today we are going to make a single folding easiest one a uh, mouse so let's start uh, to do this so to make this what we require is a triangular shape any color paper you can take whatever color paper you like a card sheet then you need few pieces here i'll just keep on telling you why we are going to use this and few googly eyes uh, a tail like i have just made a tail because the rat has a long tail right so i am using this tail this is also a thin triangle shape only and the whiskers right the mouse rat whatever we call it it has whiskers right so for whiskers i have used the black color uh, paper here so you can just see this two strips thin strips i am using or uh, you can even take the quilling strips also the thinner ones you can just use those because they are readily available in the market you can just go with it so let's start with the activity now so what we have to do is the triangle cut out which we have done so on that we are going to apply glue and we will stick it on the card paper so so while applying glue also children always remember the borders the edges whatever we call it is a must like it should be stuck properly like glued properly and even you should stick it also properly so as you can see first i always do the borders whether it uh, is a drawing it's anything i just do first borders and then i do the uh, inside part so this is how we are going to just glue it and we will stick this on the card paper or any thick sheet you can use as i always keep telling you all don't go and buy card papers because you get lot of brochures outside magazine paper also we get it's also little thick that also you can use wedding paper wedding uh, uh, cards you can use uh, for the card uh, thing so always use reuse recycle things okay so now i'm just going to cut this and i would like to mention uh, if you have a single color card paper you can just use that or if you want to use a two shaded one you can just do like this so here i got my triangle i hope you all have all have also done till here so let us take this excess part towards one side and we'll just what we are going to do is we will just fold it from this portion down from here you are going to just give one fold okay like this got it all of you like this so just give a fold here and a fold here like this this we are doing only so that this can stand properly like this okay so from uh, front side also we are just going to give a small fold and how we are going to do is like this you can just see two crease lines i have got here so just like that you also have to do in the same way okay so now the next thing is just take the whiskers to whiskers you have right glue it and stick it on the mouth part so this conical uh, thing which we have this sharp edge there we are going to stick and top of it this this thing will be like this okay a cross i hope you all can see so now you are just going to stick this just like a multiplication mark right multiplication symbol see a cross a x you can call it anything this way you are going to do and now you will just stick a small circle on it you can just see a small circle i have just done the cut out you can use help of punches also you get lot of punches outside right so you can just go and get it you can just see here i have just added one circle over there so yes so you get lot of punches outside so you have to just uh, make a small circle or you can just punch a small circle and you have to stick on the whisker okay so as i have done or you can stick on top of it also it's totally your wish what you want to do okay and then we have the eyes right eyes also what we have to do is we need let smaller set of eyes here 
can just see uh, or you can just stick the googly eyes so i'm just going with a smaller set of i just love to cut and do all the things because as uh, whatever shape i want i usually get that right so if you want a particular size you can just go and get from outside or if you want to make of your own you can just do as i am doing yes see this is how i have just made my eyes here googly eyes so now just glue this and stick on the mouse face like this okay glue it and stick and do it very slow if the googly eyes are like uh, the ready made ones so you can just apply glue and you can stick in the same way okay here and we know that mouse has a very big ears right so just take a uh, i'm going to take the red color paper because i used red here so i'll take red and uh, with that in contrast i'm just taking blue so i'll just keep this aside and what we have to do is uh, to cut the ears because we need two same size of ears right so what we will do i'm just taking a strip of paper i'll just fold it and you have to take a pencil and just draw a circular like semi circular ears i hope everybody knows this tom and jerry right so same like jerry you have to just make the ears so here my ears are ready a small curves are also enough okay like this and just cut it off okay see at a time we got two ears right that's why we do always folding and if you want two similar things we do folding and then we cut so this is how you will get two things right at the same time just check whether this uh, ears will be i think little bigger for this so what you will do is just measure once with one thing and just check it out i think little more curve we have to give yes so these two years i think it will be enough for our uh, mouse here so this is how we are going to stick okay so let me glue in the bottom of the ear you can see the bottom here and then stick it behind so everybody knows right behind it right here and stick it same way do for the other one apply glue little glue and stick behind the mouse body okay so this is how we have done i hope you all liked it and i think one thing is missing that is the tail part yes and i as i told you if you want to add something inside it uh, so you can even add another color i as i told you a smaller one you have to just cut it out of another shade and you have to just stick it here so what you will do is so we know the size of this what we will do we'll just fold it into half see i have uh, the strip is very big i'll just fold it a uh, little thing because we want a smaller uh, ear here so just make the same like that ear and cut cut it yes so i'm just showing you once again this is how you will just make a semi circle and cut it off the thing and you have to paste it on the ears this is uh, the secondary option if you want to go with it go with it otherwise leave it off so i am just showing you both the things how to do apply glue as we have done uh, for the first ear which we have stuck here just add it okay so i'll just show you oh my god so this is how it will stand also right so nursery children can do this it's nothing like that they can't do but the cut out should be ready for the child so i uh, uh, can say this please give the cut outs if parents are doing this if uh, the teachers are doing you have to give the cut outs to the children and you have to make sure that they are folding it properly and sticking it properly so this is how the 
mouse will look and last but not the least the tail part. So what we will do is we will just make few lines on the tail. Okay. So you can just see. If you have black sketch pen you can use that. So see you can just uh, see this no I have just made few lines just sleeping lines on the tail and what I will do is I will just stick this behind here or here I will just put it here okay. So I hope the tail is also ready now. So what we are going to do is we will just give a folding for the tail right yes like this and our mouse is ready to stand and you can just play this isn't it amazing do this and have fun keep doing art and crafts and stay safe stay happy take care